The Redmi Note 9 series is coming to Malaysia soon and apparently it might be a different device from what we have expected. And Huawei's latest flagship, the P40 series, will be arriving in Malaysia shortly after the global launch. <music> Xiaomi's latest Redmi Note 9 series is coming to Malaysia on the 23rd of March 2020. The new mid-range series is expected to come with a huge display and a huge battery. However, it looks like we won't be getting the Redmi Note 9 Pro and the Note 9 Pro Max that was introduced in India. According to Xiaomi Malaysia's teaser, the upcoming device for our local market will be introduced as the Redmi Note 9S. That's a weird name, but the image also confirms that it will come with a quad camera setup arranged in a Huawei Mi 20 inspired camera bump. The device has already passed our SIM certification and it is a dual SIM device that supports 4G LTE. However, it lacks NFC support which is currently available on the Redmi Note 8 Pro. Apart from LPT2 which is managed by PLUS, Touch & Go RFID is also supported on East Coast Expressway starting from the 1st of April. So that means you can enjoy easy RFID payment experience throughout the East Coast Expressway starting next month. Ani Berhad, which also manages Kuala Lumpur to Kara Expressway and Kuala Lumpur to Seremban Expressway, has made the announcement via its Facebook page. Bose is expected to be the first e-wallet to be supported on Samsung Pay in Malaysia. And ahead of its official announcement, Samsung Malaysia has dropped another clue and it shows how you can pay with Boost on your Samsung Pay interface. And if you look at the screen interface on the tweet, it appears to be using QR code to make and receive payments. This tells us that it doesn't use NFC or magnetic secure transmission and you can only use the QR code at existing Boost e-wallet merchants. Ahead of the official announcement of the Huawei P40 series, the latest 5G device has already passed Malaysia's SIRIM certification. That is also an indication that this device will be arriving in Malaysia really soon. From the listing, we can confirm that it will support 700, 3500 and 3700 MHz 5G bands as well as Wi-Fi 6. There is also NFC, dual SIM support and wireless power transfer. The launch will be taking place on the 26th of March and it will be an online event due to the COVID-19. The latest P40 series is expected to run on a Kirin 990 5G and Huawei is expected to level up its photography capability with a longer zoom range. That's it from me, so thank you guys so much for watching. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already and also click on the notification bell icon so you can stay updated to our future videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one.